Okay, let's do it. There's the other one. On to the next part. So we got the strong back put together. Essentially what this is, is it just a level flat beam made out of plywood. So all the forms that we cut are gonna get mounted on there. So everything, I use this in the other build. Everything is going to key off of this center. So the middle form is centered right here and everything builds fore and aft that way. Each station is 12 inches in this case from the middle. And I just got to level them all off for each 12. You'll notice there's some other lines here. That's from the other build. So for this one, it's 12 inches. The other one, it was stretched. So it was a little bit more than 12. So they got a little bit further apart every time. So how we do that, we take the, just a two by two here. Make sure it's square along there. Screw it onto the strong back and then uh, screw the stations onto the each two by two. So that's how each one's gonna go on. I just gotta make sure they're square. And you'll notice there's a big line all the way down. That's the center line. That's still consistent with the strong back. So everything's going to base off of that. Everything's square to that.
Setting up the forms finally. So this is the bow stem. As you can see, you got a couple stations set up already. Anchor down. And all squared off. So I gotta put the both stems on and then run a line. And then I'll put the rest of the stations in between. Make sure they square. have to do some shaping here. So stems are on. I've got the inner stems even attached to the forms and the first two stations attached to each. I also have a center line here. So this is just a piece of string. As you can see, it runs the whole length of what will be the canoe right along the center keel line of the boat. Um, so the idea of this is to make sure everything's true to the keel line. So all the rest of the stations that I put in are gonna line up on that string. Uh, yeah, this is the middle, number eight station. It's just clamped right now, and I need that in there just to make sure that it's gonna be centered. But uh, yeah, I'll start putting on the, on the other stations here and uh, show you that process. So yeah, the hard part's all done. So trying to make these level and square on three different axes. Uh, a little bit challenging, but got them all in. And uh, the other ones just basically got to screw onto here. So I'll start with the first one here, number 
13. We'll do. So that should do it. All the stations are in place. Uh, the only other thing I want to do, I'll just eyeball it, make sure that's along the center line really good because I can still adjust these a little bit. Uh, I just have to make sure, see there's a little bit of play up top. Just make sure they're even on the outside here. So near the, uh, where the strips are gonna go. But yeah. This finally, all the prep work, um, finally able to start putting boat material together. So, uh, yeah, this is the form. This is how she's going to look. Quite a bit narrower than the other one. I can, uh, not very, this is the widest point. So, should be interesting. Interesting build. Stay with me.